I sold my soul to the devil. Have we sold our soul to the devil? I sold my soul. There are people who have no idea that they have committed the unforgivable sin. Watch these celebrities talk about selling their souls and then watch this pastor's response. I swear I wanted to be like the Amy Grant of music. Yeah. <laughs> but it didn't work out and so I sold my soul to the devil. I sold my soul. And uh, ever since I sold my soul, I haven't been happy ever since. We'll get to the pastor's response soon, but first, three questions for these celebrities. One, are you at all afraid of the consequences of continuing to mock and reject God? Two, do you know just how serious it is to embrace evil and the devil? Three, did you know Jesus has complete victory over the devil? They're comfortable and they ought to be frightened because they're headed for eternal hell. There are other people who think they've committed the unforgivable sin and haven't and need to be comforted. Through the years of my ministry, of course, I've met both kinds of people. The comfortable who ought to be frightened and the frightened who ought to be comfortable. To hear more biblical truth like this, do subscribe.